right so sorry I, i was not recording the session we missed around 5 to 10 minutes of recording right so this is the chrome driver object which i have created over here and i was trying to tell you similarly to firefox driver you have chrome driver as well when you create the object of chrome driver and you execute the code you get an error don't be afraid of the error what i do is i copy the first line of the error and go to google and paste the error over there i get the solution nobody is perfect nobody knows complete selenium this is the fact but people work on it by searching on google even this is true with me i never know about so many classes which are present in this api nobody can know right but when i have work i search it i search it on google then look in the api then search on google then look in the api and that's how you learn it okay right now basically why it gives an error and how to overcome error of chrome driver it's very simple uh, you go to seleniumhq.org website under the download section you will have this section third party drivers not developed by selenium hq and you will have chrome click on this and just just be with me go to down just hold on go to this link and go under the folder 2.9 you need to download an exe file for chrome right you go to 2.9 and download chrome based on your operating system whatever op- operating system you have download that zip file and extract it fine in my pc i have extracted it under the folder this folder this is chrome driver.exe you need to download this file from that link i'll give you the link this is the link i'll give you on webex chat fine you need to download chrome driver.exe and place it like i have placed it over here there is no need to run this exe file what you need to do is that you need to write this is mandatory in selenium you need to write system dot set property web driver dot chrome dot driver and give the path to chrome driver dot exe over here that is it's lying under this folder this is how you work with chrome driver you have to give the path of this chrome driver and set it in the system properties now what is system dot set property system is a class this is an inbuilt class in java language and set property is the function present inside the system class this is a static function this set property is a static function under the system class okay himanshu uh, there was himanshu asked question there is no for firefox no with firefox you don't need to do this kind of stuff only with chrome and i right now when you run this the driver hold on always copy paste the name chrome driver spelling mistake when you run this you will have chrome running you see this blank chrome has opened up okay so it's quite simple fine similarly with i for i you have got i'll just write i n t e r hit control space bar and i'll get various classes starting with the word i n t e r okay enter net explorer driver this is the one okay i'll create the object of this driver this one yeah new internet explorer driver all right and then write over here i dot get to the url http 
say gmail.com so when you run this chrome opens but i never opens for i also you get an error okay what you need to do is that you need you need to check the system property for i as well go to the website for selenium official website for selenium go to the download link and you will find the section the internet explorer driver download the exe file for 32 bit or 64 bit i depending on your machine i have downloaded it and i have kept it under the same location out here again there is no need to run this what you need to do is that you need to write over here system dot set property web driver dot i dot driver and give the path right along with this there are other settings available as well right which you need to do especially if you're using 7 or 8 windows 7 or 8 right come actually i'll just answer you give me two minutes right what you need to do is that first of all make sure that protected mode in i is turned off okay if you don't know how to turn it off just go to google and search it you'll get step by step description turn off protected mode in i you will come to know okay you just have to go over here follow the instructions and turn off the protected mode secondly make sure in I, zoom level is set to 100%. If that is not the case, it's not going to execute. So these are the three settings which you need to do for I. This one setting you need to do for Chrome and for Firefox, there is no setting. If you run this code, you will find that Chrome opens. And after that, Hold on. You see that I also opens up, and that this is the initial page for web driver and Gmail opens. I am having I7 on this server machine right now, but it works. All right. So guys, for every driver or for every browser, you have a different driver. For Safari, you have got a Safari driver which is not very stable many things they don't work on it right there was a question being asked what is the shortcut key to get full class names it's like that you write some initial words you write e i n t e r and that then hit control space bar of your keyboard you will get the names okay because i'll never like to write such a big name so i'll just write the initial few words control space bar and then select okay so I will not go beyond this to be very honest with you because this really is confusing. I know the day one I just want to 